Crossroads Children's Mental Health Center is Ottawa's community leader, developing and delivering a range of individualized mental health services solely for children under the age of 12 and their families. Crossroads Children's Mental Health Center is accredited by the Canadian Center for Accreditation. Our vision is of a community where every child receives treatment for even the most severe mental health challenges. No case is too complicated, complex or severe. We never give up on a child. All of our classrooms are low ratio. So this means that every classroom has a maximum of eight kids in the class and they're supported by three adults, one teacher, one education assistant, and one child and youth worker. Our entire day is a balance between the Ontario curriculum and the mental health treatment that your child is coming to our program to receive. If the kids are not settled, if they're having difficulties, um, if they're not regulated, they can't get their work done. What we've decided is sitting down as a group, EA, myself, and the teacher sit down and find out what is the best time the kids will learn academics or they can focus. So we'll decide that and then we'll come up times when we do academics and come up with times when we're gonna do other things. When we say your kid will not be suspended for at least one year, you can see how the, the stress just drop. Whatever problems we have in the school or the kids have, we work through it through problem solving. We do include the parents with whenever something happens, we have to call the parents, we have to let them know, but they're never suspended. We work on all the problems and they figure out and come up with a solution. Our philosophy is behavior first, academic second. So it, it is a school, so they are provided academics, but it's done in an individual basis. The parents provided the same academics, but they do have different supports depending on their needs. So whether we scribe for them or pull out, I mean, some kids have difficulty with noise. So depending on, on their issue and the presenting problem we address, we, we try to have goals that address their needs. That's balancing the academics. Once we have offered a spot to your family in the program, there are two remaining steps before your child's first day, the intake and the admissions. The intake interview is a conversation between you and the program clinician. During our conversation, I'll ask some questions about past experiences your child may have had to help us better understand their needs. After our intake is complete, your child will be assigned to a classroom and to a child and youth worker. Your CYW will reach out to you to schedule an admission meeting, which typically takes place in person at our school site. Your CYW will go over the risks and benefits of this program and answering any remaining questions you might have. By the end of the admissions meeting, you and your CYW will have decided on a start date for your child. Your CYW will be your primary contact person for as long as your child remains in our program. We view this as a partnership. We know that home and school need to work together to best support your child. So what we expect from caregivers while your child is in our program is mostly communication. It's important for us to know if your child will not be attending on any given day. It's important for us to have an emergency contact in case we can't reach you and we need to. And it's important for us to know if there are any major changes in your child's life or let's say medication changes or things that might be helpful for us to know as we're spending the school day with your child. We also have quarterly treatment plan meetings, which is a time for us to go over the goals we've been working on with your child. And we do expect that caregivers attend those meetings and be part of those conversations with us. In the Crossroads Day Treatment Program, we firmly believe that children do well if they can. When they can't, we need to understand what is getting in their way of success. In our shared mission of help for children, hope for families, together we are building a strong foundation of strength, resilience, and brighter tomorrows.